almost everyone loves to play with puppies, and having one join the family is a dream for many children and adults. While most people are aware that raising a puppy can be a lot of work, far fewer recognize that in rare circumstances, these same cute puppies could be carrying drug-resistant pathogens. This was the case when an outbreak of multi-drug-resistant Campylobacter infections was recently investigated by the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, the U.S. Department of Agriculture's Animal and Plant Health Inspection Service, and several state agencies. The CDC reports that Campylobacter is one of the most common causes of diarrheal illness in the United States. For this multi-state outbreak, the agency published a final outbreak advisory in January of 2018. The document reports the following. A total of 113 people with laboratory confirmed infections or symptoms consistent with Campylobacter infection were linked to this outbreak. Illnesses were reported from 17 states. Illnesses started on dates ranging from January of 2016 to January of 2018. Ill people ranged in age from less than one year old to 86 with a median age of 27. 63% of ill people were female. Of 103 people with available information, 23 were hospitalized. No deaths were reported. Whole genome sequencing showed that isolates from people infected with Campylobacter were closely related genetically. This close genetic relationship means that people in this outbreak were more than likely to share a common source of infection. The CDC went on to share that in interviews, 99% of people reported contact with a puppy in the week before the illness started, and 87% reported that they had contact with a puppy from a specific chain of pet stores, or had contact with a person who became sick after contact with a puppy from the pet store chain. 25 ill people worked at the pet store chain in question. To help prevent the spread of Campylobacter infections, it is a good idea to always wash one's hands thoroughly with soap and water after touching a puppy or dog, after handling their food, and after cleaning up after them. In addition to the importance of hygiene and handling practices, environmental testing is also available to identify contaminated surfaces and materials to help prevent the spread of the bacteria and verify cleaning and disinfection procedures. These are just a few things to know about Campylobacter infections and pet store puppies. To learn more about this or other microbial, environmental health, or safety issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.